Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you using jQuery how to add empty rows in a table. I am reloading the browser. See here we got a new output after adding the jQuery functionality to hide the empty rows in this table. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am using Notepad++. Now in this Notepad++, just for the time saving, I have already added a table with some dummy data. The headers are employee ID, employee name and email, which contains some rows. You can find in this table some empty rows. This is the empty row and this is the empty row. Now before adding the jQuery functionality to hide the empty rows in this table, Let's check the basic output how it looks the designing part on the browser. And this is the output of that code. Notice there is the empty rows in this table. Now let's hide these empty rows using jQuery. Now when we are using jQuery, the first thing we require the latest jQuery CDN link. Let's search for jQuery latest CDN Google and from the search results, I am selecting the hosted libraries. And notice in the Google hosted libraries, at the corner, there is a contents panel which contains the jQuery. Click that one. You can find different versions of jQuery snippets. I am selecting the latest jQuery CDN 3.3.1. Just copy this one and add. In our header section, I am adding after the style. After that, I am adding one more script tag to write the jQuery code dollar document dot ready function Now in this ready function, I want to hide these empty rows from this table dollar between double quotes, I'm adding the ID of the table, which is a table one. When we are adding IDs in the jQuery or JavaScript, we need to add the prefix. Table one, I want to add the tr td dot. I'm adding each function. Now in this function, I'm declaring a variable to get the empty rows. Variable empty rows is equals to dollar dot trim function dollar this dot text method. Now I'm adding if condition. If I found any the empty rows in this table using this variable empty rows if empty rows dot length property is equals to double equals to zero I want to add that rows dollar this dot parent method dot hide method that's it, we have written the code to add the empty rows in this table. Let's save this file. We'll check the final results on the browser. I'm reloading the browser. See here we got a new output after adding the jQuery functionality to hide the empty rows in this table. That's it.